Alright, so this is how to put some games to your Samsung moment. You go to the market, go to search, type in um, emulators. Um, some of these are free, but the ones, the free ones, you can like save the games. So if you want to buy it, you'll be able to save the game. But I got the free ones, so uh, it doesn't really matter. So let's say you want the um, NES one, just this one right here. Just download it. And you go to it. Okay. It'll, if you download it, you open it. I'll say this. Um, you're gonna have to download some ROMs, and I'm gonna show you how to do that. So you put it in there. Alright, to download them, um, you gotta search, um, you gotta go to this website. Right here, go to a corner to search, type in NES. Here, so once this all system change it to go to look for Nintendo Entertainment System and just type in any game you want. I'm just gonna download the Mario Brothers. And the uh, list should pop up. Um, you can get anyone you want. I got the, the one that says Japan USA. It's like the original. Go down to where it says download links. Click on it. Click, um, click on this again. Save the file. Alright, so it's downloading. I'm downloading. Alright, then you take the the SD card out of your cell phone. You put it into the adapter. To this, you put it in the computer. Um, then right here, um. Make a new folder. Um, you can call it whatever you want, but I call it NES ROMs. Alright, open it. Back to downloads. Open that download. This will show up. Just get that. And slide it over to the two files. And. Once you're there, you can put any other ones if you want. Just go back to the website. Just go from here. Go back to Nintendo. Then it has like the whole list of all the games that they have available. So you can download any you want, and if you if you download some another emulator, you just go to right here to corner, and you pick the system that you download it for. Let's say Sega or the 
Game Boy, whatever you got. So close that. Take this D card out. Put, put it back in the phone. Turn it on. Then you just go to the app, you download it, the NES. Yeah. You go to where it says load. Then that's all the games I downloaded. So here's that Mario one. This is Mario 3. Yeah. Because we got the other one too. This is the one I downloaded. And if you don't like, it has some buttons set already, but if you don't like the ones already set, you press menu, go to settings, go to key settings, and, uh, just right there. Let's say you want the A button to be some other one. Press that one and just press any key you want. Let's say I want to put it back to S. So and then it just goes back to that. You just press back. You go back to the game. Yeah. So that's how you. That's how you do it. Um. Thanks.